Hello children. Welcome once again. Today we are going to do our third part of first chapter that is organization of CPU. You know what is CPU? Yes. CPU full form is central processing unit. It controls its working and CPU is also called the brain of computer. You know children, a computer cannot do any task on its own. We need to give data and instructions to make it work. So we can say that a computer works in three simple steps. That is input, process and output. So, the basic digital computer functions is given here. When we will enter any input, any data, CPU will do the processing and then only we can get the output as a result. As for example, you can take a cake. You know how cake is prepared? You can divide the steps of preparing cake into three steps. First step is preparing batter, that is input. Then you have to keep that batter in the oven, that is called processing. And after few minutes, when you will get a cooked cake, that is called output. So for this, you must know what are the input unit input units are the devices that give data and instruction to the computer for example keyboard mouse light pen scanner etc input unit wo sari units hain wo sare devices hain jo computer mein data feed karne ka kaam karte hain Data instruction ko computer mein dene ka kaam karte hai, help karte hai. Second one is CPU, that is Central Processing Unit. It is responsible for processing the data for the users. In the case of cake, we have just discussed na, that in oven, the batter will be processed, means cooked. In the same manner, in computer, whenever we will give some data to perform any calculations, the processing will be done in CPU. So, CPU acts as a brain of computer. And CPU has three parts. First part is control unit, CU. Control unit controls all the components by Issuing control signals. Sare cheezo ko process ko jo control karta hai. CPU mein that is called control unit. Naam se samaj mein a raha hai control unit. It will control all the components by issuing control signals. Next is ALU. Arithmetic and logical unit. As arithmetic and logic the two words is a mathematical words so by this you can understand that this will perform all the calculations and carries out the instructions of a computer program perform the basic arithmetical and logical operations jitne operations hote hain plus minus multiply divide is sare operations less than greater than Sare cheez kis mein honge? ALU mein. Second part. Third part is memory unit. Third is memory unit. Control kar liya. Processing kar liya. Ab usko data ko yaad rakhna hai. Store karna hai. So what memory unit will do? Stores data instructions. And result of processing. जो प्रोसेस हुआ उसका क्या रिजल्ट आया वो कहाँ सेव हो जाएगा कहाँ स्टोर होगा 
in memory unit the third unit of the cpu so in this way we can see here cpu has three parts first is control unit second is arithmetic and logical unit and third is memory unit now the third part of cpu organization is output unit output unit the device that display or give the results after process output devices इसको बोलते हैं आउटपुट डिवाइसेज हम लोगों ने कुछ डेटा डाला फिर कैलकुलेशन हुआ तो उसका आंसर कहाँ दिखेगा मॉनिटर पे या प्रिंटर से प्रिंट कर सकते हैं स्पीकर से हम लोग गाना सुनते हैं वो भी एक तरह से आउटपुट है लाइक दिस वी कैन सी हियर ऑल द आउटपुट डिवाइसेज गिवेन नाउ इन दिस वे वी अंडरस्टैंड द बेसिक डिजिटल कंप्यूटर हाउ इट वर्क्स सो चिल्ड्रेन आई होप यू ऑल हैव फिनिश्ड योर चैप्टर वन वेरी नाइसली यू हैव सीन ऑल द थ्री वीडियोज केयरफुली एंड अंडरस्टैंड ऑल द कॉन्सेप्ट वेरी वेल नाउ आई विल गिव यू ऑल द एक्टिविटीज ऑफ चैप्टर वन इन वन वीडियो एंड यू हैव टू डू दैट एक्टिविटी इन योर लैब मैनुअल कॉपी Thank you for watching. Have a nice day. Stay at home. Stay safe. Bye bye.